And so inside my analytics, if you look here, I used it on this video, 784,000 views. On this video, 548,000. I used it on this video, 492,000, 230,000, and so on. So you can see using this simple trick works. What's going on? So today I'm going to show you a super simple method that you can use to start getting more views absolutely free. Also, I'm going to show you a YouTube feature that not many people are aware of that can help you grow as well, will help you save time, and you only have to set this up once. So if you're interested in growing on YouTube, be sure to subscribe and set notifications because I share the same methods I use to grow multiple channels across various niches, and I'm always learning and sharing more. Okay, so let's get started. And as you can see, we're inside my analytics and you'll notice we have some videos here with a lot of views. Now, none of these videos went viral. That is, these videos are getting views simply because they're doing well in the search and suggest results. And to me personally, you have way more control over how you get your videos in the search and suggest results versus how, how well you can get your videos to go viral. And so what I'm gonna show you is a super easy trick that you can use as well. So one thing that we've been seeing is that video tags are becoming less and less important in terms of getting your video ranked or in terms of getting your YouTube to determine where your videos belong, where they're gonna be shown around its platform and who they're gonna be suggested to. That said, the title is believed to be the most important factor for telling YouTube what your video is about and who to put that video in front of. Now, of course, having a good description full of keywords is a good idea too, but again, it's the title that we really wanna focus on. So in a second, I'm gonna show you a couple tricks you can use with your titles, but before we do, I wouldn't suggest not putting any tags in your videos. YouTube still has that feature available, so it's still likely to serve a purpose. And you never know when YouTube's algorithm may change and tags could become important again. But rather than mess with them all the time and with every video you do, if you go into your YouTube studio and you scroll down and hit settings, and then you just go to upload defaults, and this is where you can actually input information that YouTube will save for you. So it's already gonna be in there every time you upload a new video. You could even save a title in here. I'm not sure why you would do that unless you wanna just keep a few keywords in there that you use routinely. You can create a whole description that will automatically be available when you go to upload a video. It'll already be there for you. But what we're gonna focus on, what I typically look at, is the tag. So this is where you can put tags in just relevant to your niche in general and then just hit save. And then every time you go into your video editor, after you upload a video, it's all the stuff's gonna be in here for you so you don't have to mess with the tags anymore. But for now, what I do is I just keep in general tags that relate to my niche and getting subscribers and I just let them roll. So again, that's inside your YouTube studio, go to settings and then go to upload defaults and that's where you can save these, this information. Okay, so back to the title. So with this method, what you're gonna do is create your keyword rich title but then the trick is you can actually create two titles and just combine them together into one long title. So now you are doubling your chances of getting your video ranked and getting YouTube to offer your video to more people based on those keywords. So as an example, and we look at some of my videos, let's go ahead and hover over this one so we can see the title. So as you can see, the first part of my title is how to get subscribers on YouTube fast. That is actually a title all by itself. Now I could have put a hyphen in there or a straight line up and down, and then I could have added this next part, but I just chose to put it in parentheses. But if you look, it's really another title get more subscribers on YouTube. So since this title is telling YouTube, it is about how to get subscribers, how to get subscribers on YouTube, how to get them fast. It's also about how to get more subscribers. So you can see it can appeal and be offered in front of a lot of different people that are searching for a lot of different things. So some people might search for get subscribers. Well, those tags are in there. Those keywords are in there. It, they might be searching for how to get subscribers on YouTube. Well, that's in there. How to get subscribe subscribers fast. That's in there. How to get more subscribers. All that is in there by extending this into two titles. Move to the next video and you can see the same thing. Get real subscribers fast subscriber hat. And then here again, it's separated, but it's really two titles. The second part, the second title combined with the first one is grow your YouTube channel fast. So here's another example, a slightly different group I'm going after here. This is make money watching YouTube videos and the second part of that title or the second title combined together, make money online 2021. So now you can see with this one video, I have two different groups of people I could be going after. There's people that are specifically looking for ways to make money if they could just watch YouTube videos, could they make money that way? So they're looking for ways to do that. This video could be offered to them by YouTube because YouTube 
through this title says, oh, that's what this video is about. Conversely, there could be a whole other group of people that are looking just in general, how to make money online in 2021. And again, my video, because the title states that, YouTube could potentially offer this video to some of those people as well. And of course, with either case, they could suggest this video next to other videos that are about those, these topics. So as you can see, it's just a very simple way to expand the reach of your videos. And through the different combinations of these longer titles, you could appeal to multiple different groups of people looking for different things related to that one video. So that said, don't just go out there and just throw up whatever video title you think will work. Put a little bit more thought into it. Be sure to focus on keywords and come up with two titles, combine them together into one as I've shown you, and it can drastically help with your video views. So let me know what you think in the comments below with that. I'm gonna wrap this video up and I will see you in the next.